After becoming Western Canada champions for the fifth straight time, the Golden Bears and Pandas tennis teams have to continue to wait until the end of summer to defend their national championship title at the Rogers Cup in Toronto. You don't ever want to do worse the following season than you did this year before. And you know, uh, following up with another national championship was going to be a big, a big chore. And uh, we know that it's not a given, but uh, we're going to do our best to, to, to do it again. The format has changed in nationals to now having the men and women compete separately. And with the new rosters, overall team depth has become essential. So I think the players who are at the kind of the bottom of our lineup are going to come more into play. So um, we're going to need the same kind of uh, performance from our top players, the top uh, three positions we had last year. But we're going to need equally the same kind of performance from, from our numbers four to six. The teams continue to win year after year thanks to strong recruiting as the attractiveness of the program keeps top local talent in green and gold. Only the men's team will be losing a player to graduation for the upcoming season, so already looking ahead, the team is confident. Last year we recruited a lot of new players, so we have a lot of young players that are going to be with us for, for a few years, as well as a number of real strong prospects coming in. However, for now the focus is still on nationals, where the teams will be looking to bring home a couple new banners to add to their collection. For Golden Bears and Pandas, I'm Daniil Anselmi.